Welcome to our first ever Innocent Inspires evening. I can promise you this, it's definitely going to be worth it. I've just been speaking to the three guys that are going to be talking to you this evening. They've just got some really interesting thoughts to share with us. And I think that's basically what this concept's all about. It's about giving us some things to think about, some sources of inspiration, hence the name Innocent Inspires. And tonight the topic is very much about how to live well and die old. It's our company purpose. It's the thing that explains why we do what we do. We're going to hear about that greatest force in the universe, the power of human will, from James Cracknell, one of the absolute legends of the sporting world. That was the best nightclub entry I've ever had. <laughs> was taken in the American base at South Park was 75 kilos. It's an expensive way to lose weight, but it does work. Anyone can win once, real champions do it again. But the only way to guarantee you win that race is that your worst is better than everyone else's best. And that was what we had as a training mantra within our training was that it's not just going through the motions, it's doing it to the best of your ability. Next up, I want to introduce you to Charlie Dark. I basically started running very late at night because I was embarrassed about running around East London in Lycra. I thought to myself, I'm going to have to do something about this. I'm going to start running and I'm going to find four of my friends. And we're going to make a crew. It's not going to be a club, it's going to be a crew. We'd run on a Friday night and we'd run a mile and a half. Five and a half years later, we now have five sessions a week. On our Tuesday session, we are now at a point where we're getting about 200 people per session. The running is the least important part of what Run Limb Crew does. It's about the act of bringing positive people together to share an activity and then basically finding out what other stuff they have. Your PB means nothing if you haven't helped some people along the way. The guy in the black sacrificed his PB to basically help his friend reach the finish line. That, for me, sums up what Run Limb Crew is about and what running means to me. Ladies and gentlemen, the last of our three star speakers this evening, Dr Pixie McKenna. I'm not an Olympian, I'm not a member of a crew, but for most of you, I'm that irritating woman that flashes up on your television screen with a willy while you're trying to eat your tea. <laughs> we spend, on average, 44 minutes every day thinking about food. That's actually far more time than we spend thinking about sex. On a weekly basis, that's over five hours. Goodness me, if the great British public spent that five hours exercising, I think life would be very, very different. And I always annoy the hell out of my patients by saying, have you ever heard of a fella called Barack Obama? And they're like, yeah, why? You know Barack Obama goes jogging? If you are busier than Barack Obama, <laughs> I take my hat off to you. But otherwise, get up off your asses. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, three exceptional people. Also, James Cracknell, Dr. Pixie McKenna, and Charlie Dark. <laughs>